All right, so for this edition of Surveyor's Corner, Lem Morrison, a licensed professional surveyor, is here to explain why you might want to survey your property and when it's time to update it. So I'm going to turn it over to you, Lem. Thank you, Brittany, and uh, thank you for inviting me here. Uh, this is a question we get a lot, you know, um, ha is my survey still good? And your survey that you get from, from your surveyor, you know, shows your property was fixed, was plainly visible. And those are the things, um, you know, they're, they're observed at the time, time of the survey. Most will stay the same, but they don't, things change over, over time. There are sudden changes and gradual changes. So most of the times when you need a survey is when the property is bought or sold. You've made mm -hmm. a big investment and you spend a lot of money, a lot of time, a lot of sweat and tears into a house. It's a big investment. You want to make sure you're getting what you paid for. It's where you're going to live and you want to see where everything is. Mm -hmm. uh, not only ownership, but, but compliance with setbacks and what you have. Um, so that's typically when most people get a survey. The other question is when you want to change something. You want to add a new deck, a new driveway. Maybe you've made a, you're going to make a big addition to the family and you want to make a new, a new wing um, to your house. You know, that's going to require at a minimum a survey so you know what's there. But the town, most towns are going to require that as part of your building permit. Yeah. So I just bought a house and we're looking to install a new fence, which I'm sure is something that a lot of people are contemplating in the summer. Um, there was a survey that came with our property documents, but it is from about 15 years ago. Like, are we able to still use that one or should we be updating what we're going to be using when installing this fence? Great question. And the answer we'll give is, is it just depends, right? It depends where you're, where you're living, how old it is and, you know, kind of what's required and your own, your own comfort level. The, the role that we give to about surveyors is is quasi judicial. Is that, you know, the, a lot of trust is given to to doc to to doctors and any professionals, much you would and you would give that to to surveyors, and we're going to apply math and physics and the law to show what was found at the time of the survey accurately and precisely. And those are the things you just mentioned, the the fence that indicates the property line, what somebody thought was their property line at some point. Um, fences and uh, house driveways um it's all related to the, to the property line now the, the question is do you do you need it or not again it depends because that's going to come down to come down to the town where you are if you're in a very rural area um you're and it, not much has changed in 15 years okay the grass is a little little thicker the trees are taller but the fence is still you're it's still there um and you're just going to replace it right in there you're comfortable. There's not much of a uh, need for a change. That's definitely a decision by the, by the homeowner. Contrast that to a denser area, a suburban, higher values, and perhaps a lot has changed. Your 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 neighbors put up their own fence, <laughs> and yours is falling down. And you know maybe there's been some sort of property line change, and your town may say, "Listen." you're you're gonna need you're gonna need a survey um so that's that's gonna be a requirement and a good rule of thumb a lot of every town's gonna be different but a good rule of thumb is going to be is gonna be a year it's something that's within a year some mm -hmm. towns may be different and there may have been so many changes that you're saying well i don't know if that fence is right that the neighbor put up and you're gonna want a, a brand new survey just just to make sure yeah all right. Well, I'm sure you and I are going to take this offline and a lot of the listeners will be able to kind of move forward with their backyard renovations and home improvements. But thanks so much for your time today, Lem. You're welcome. Anytime.